Welcome to my store. Center at York University. Hortensia and I are going. We're going to see country music under the stars, which means it better not rain. Do you, uh, you dump them with the guys? Yeah. When you dump them, make sure that uh, any sand in the bottom, Sorry. you don't dump out. So okay. tilt them slowly. Uh, to, yeah. There's going to be sand in the bottom. Since I wish I had a ring, uh, ring in there. What do you go? What do you get sold for? I should put it. You only like two or three dollars. Oh, he's, he's he tells me to overprice things. I don't overprice anything. They're all fair and reasonable prices. And why would Steve be buying it off me anyhow? He's buying it off the wholesale. No, because the fact that uh, you know the, the uh, that's our we use one for the algae and stuff, and the other one for the fish. Yeah. There's no, there's one with the best. Well, I got about 50 nets in the truck at any one point in time. Well, I can tell you, uh, I, I suppose I'll, I'll, I'll even go to college place and get them all if I have to. That's me close to the other person. Well, did you ever see my stick net? No. Oh, I did, yeah. Yeah, it's yeah. got like the 10 foot uh, yeah. tree on it. Yeah, that's for the uh, ones that are in the wall, sort of thing. No, that's for my above ground. No, 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 no. I got ones with even longer pole. I use them for swamping. Yeah, you know when you go into the swamp and yeah. catch stuff? Well, well, uh, well yes. you don't want to have to go everywhere and pick stuff up, so you get a really long handle, and you tie a net to the other end of it, and that way you can reach the stuff without actually having to walk through the water to get there. Oh. Yeah, swamp them. You've watched some of our swamp them videos, haven't you? I don't think so. No? No. So you only watch the videos where you're in them? Well, whether I'm in them or not, I have to watch them when, when uh, Steve watches them. Yeah. That's when I get inside of your, uh, your store or that's where it's, uh, store. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that, uh, I haven't seen much for outside yet. Huh. Well, we did some swamping videos. Uh, we're going to be posting some uh, videos for Aaron and I went fishing. Okay. And I caught the biggest fish and I caught the smallest fish. You ever see a hook that catches a fish that size? No kidding, really. Number 26. I showed one guy the hook, and he says, I can't see the hook. These things are so tiny that you can't get fishing line any more than like number two, number four test. Yeah. What are you looking at? See. Yeah, that's the same. It's better the basketball. I don't know which Um, probably put it in the toilet bag. Just make sure you don't dump the sand. Hello? Speaking. Yeah? Yeah, well, I haven't got the revised invoice yet, and uh, John really hasn't talked to me for a couple weeks either. So nothing's going to happen until that all happens, because I want a refund uh, based on all this torture you guys are putting me through. Hi. Yeah, but I haven't got nothing. So basically, once I get something and I... I talked to John Lilly. Hang on one second. Hello? I am good. How are you? Yeah, yeah. Can you send me an email with all this? Because right now I'm playing the fish tank to do the video. Sorry, can I just show you something the elevator? Yeah. So when you guys yeah. are ready to go? Yeah, sure. Um, Charles Aquarium, one word, for punctuation. Okay. Um, Aquarium at hotmail.com. Okay? Thanks. Hello? Yeah, so uh, basically once I talk to John, because uh, uh, this isn't uh, good business. Uh, you guys are extremely disorganized and are not pleased with the uh, service at all. So, uh, once I get the revised invoice and we'll deal, uh, then uh, I'm sure I'll be talking with John and they'll get taken care of. Okay. Uh, yeah, well, we're going to be dealing with John Lily on this because he's the uh, person I understand that deals with it. And uh, as you well know, I'm not happy with the uh, service that uh, your company has provided. So, well, I gotta get the invoice first. The mail just started up again on Monday. Okay? 
Okay. Yeah, let me get some paper. What? What's your paper bill? Well, yellow pages. You know, you know so the last time they went on strike a few years ago, it was always the case uh, while you overdrew. Uh, uh, when you no, 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 no. The yellow pages has been torturing me for about a year. Oh, yellow pages. Hello? Katie. How you doing? Good. Uh, yeah, we just ran the fish tank. Yes. 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 Yes, that is possible. What color did you want? Uh, there's blue, there's red, and then there's multicolored. Yeah, multicolored is a bunch of different blue bits. Okay. Okay, and uh, next week, good? Okay, do you want to give me a call on Tuesday? Uh, and uh, hopefully I got some at the store. If not, uh, I'll probably pick some up next week. Uh, regular bet is 450. Okay? Okay. Okay. Bye. Bye. Hey, she should tell me, uh, show me out there how to get downstairs, the button, the whole van, and you get it out where we came from. Yeah. There's a Chris J.R. Floyd, for the top Yeah. I have to get it out now where we came from. Okay. So, it's already, it's already set up out there. Then you got the padding on it. Yeah? On service, yeah. That's good. That's what you told me. It's no problem. Yeah. No, uh, basically the yellow pages, the guy phones me up and he says, okay, Carl, want to sign you up for another year. And I'm thinking, okay, well, I'm not getting any business from the yellow pages. It costs me 200 bucks a month. And I certainly ain't getting $200 worth of business from it. And so fine. He says, go online. Okay? It'll cost you the same. Okay, fine. So uh, we go on a bunch more directories online and it's supposed to cost me the same. They sent me a bill for $285. What happened to the same? 200 bucks. So I phone him up and he says, oh man, that's a mistake, it'll be changed. The next month I get another bill for 285 bucks. And the next month, and the next month. Then I keep phoning him and I say, like, what's going on? And he says, oh, it's going to be straightened out, it's going to be straightened out. And then they don't straighten it out. So then they start phoning me saying, you owe us money. Well, I ain't paying the bill until it gets straightened out. Plus, we now know that it doesn't work. Okay? Like, I didn't get any business from the, the Yellow Pages online at all. I had one person come into the store and say Yellow Pages brought them here. Everybody comes from YouTube videos and Kijiji. Okay? So, uh, basically, for the torture, the pain, the suffering, etc., I want a deal! You know? Like, I don't phone them up and uh, say that they're not paying their bills. They phone me up. They won't straighten out my stuff. And so they keep phoning. But I'm not going to settle it up until it's been settled, because once you give them money, they never give it back.